Hello friends, I'm so glad you could join me today. I am documenting my journey on becoming debt-free again, so welcome to Second Chance Budgeting. I'll be exploring cash stuffing and unstuffing, finding ways to increase my income, and saving towards some big goals. I will digging myself out of debt once again. I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you join me during my adventures. Today is going to be a little bit of a um, impromptu video. Um, what I have to do today is I have to unstuff um, money from my trip that I just took. I just got back a couple days ago and then, um, I'm combining that with my mid month check-in. So, um, so I'm unstuffing through the 25th and that's going to include all my expenses up until that date. And my goal today is to figure out how much money I've left for the rest of the month because I was not paying attention to any of that when I was on my trip. I just, um, was having fun with my family, um, enjoying my nieces and nephews, all that good stuff. So, um, I apologize if it's a little chaotic today, um, but I'm just getting back into the swing of things, back into work mode and back into filming mode. So, um, thanks for hanging in there with me. Okay. So what I've done is I have listed out, um, like where I went and then, um, kind of categorized it like, if it's my um, monthly expenses like food, gas, or other, I have those in columns. And then um, if I need to pull it from a sinking fund, I just kind of put the amounts over here and then how much I need to end stuff for that. Um, so let's try to do food, gas, and other first. Um, I, um, like I said, I'm, I'm just getting back into the swing of things. This is kind of a more realistic look of how I how I do it, um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna total up all my food, gas, and other costs, and then we'll go ahead and unstuff that and then um, go into my sinking fund. So I will speed you up. Um, <laughs> so let me just um, calculate all that. Okay, so that total for food is going to be 6614. My gas total is 3470. And then let me calculate other. Okay. So that total is 3030. 30. Okay. So like I said, let me unstuff that first. Um let's see this is how unorganized I am at the moment, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and take out my money from my change fund. It should be $40 in smaller bills. So um, at the very end, um, I'll have to make sure I pull $40 and put it back into my change fund, um, but that's gonna help me break some of my bigger bills. Okay, so let me get into food. Um, so, um, it looks like I need to end. So the total is 6614. I'm going to just round up to 67. So let me put in 80. And I'm going to give myself 13 back in change. Oops, 13. Perfect. And then gas is 34.70, so I'll round that up to 35. Okay, and I'll give myself five back and change for that. Okay, and then other is 30.30. Um, I think what I'll do Since I've rounded up, I think I'm just gonna put in $30. And that should be okay, it'll, it'll cover that. That way um, I don't have to give myself $9 and change. Um, okay, so that is everything there. Okay, so let's go ahead and unstuff the rest of these. So it looks like for medical, I just have 
Um, one expense. Sorry, let me think where I put that. <laughs> okay. Um, so medical, I need to unstuff 866 and I'll take nine. Let's see. Okay. I'll put in a 10 and give myself a $1 bill back. Perfect. Let me check that off just so we remember that. Um, giving, it looks like I've got two things that I need to um, take back to the bank. So 1344 plus, or 1306 plus 944, 2250. So I'll do 23. Let's see. Okay, so I've got one. So twenty one two three. Perfect. Okay, so let me check those off. Okay, I have two travel expenses, so let me add those together. Plus twenty two oh six. So 48.91, so I'm gonna round that up to 49. And that should be in this binder, I believe. Okay, so unstuffing 49. So we'll do 20, 40, 50. And I'll give myself $1 back. And that's probably not everything. I do um, need to fill up my tank, so I'll unstuff that at the end of the month. But again, I'm just trying to see where I'm at as far as um, how much money I've left for the left left for the rest of the month, and then um, see where I'm in sinking funds. But that one was fine. Okay, um, let me unstuff clothing. That should be in here as well. So um, it's just $6. I found something really good at, on a clearance sale at Marshall's. So um, I was like, gotta do it. So let me, okay, so $6. I'll put 21 in and grab 15 back. Okay, so I've got three, 16 left, so perfect. check that one off um okay so i bought a journal and i was kind of trying to figure out where i should unstuff that from i think i'm going to be a little bit short on other money um, i had 30 dollars left there so I, I think i'll just take this from hobbies so um, and that should be okay. Yeah, I'll just take it from there. So I've got 30 left in hobbies. So let me check that off. And then I had some like food, like travel food. Um, I think what I want to do, if I have enough money in my food budget, I might just take it from there. So let me see how much I've got left. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33. Okay, perfect. I've got plenty there. So um, let me add those together really quick. So 13, oops, 13, 44. Four plus seventeen oh seven. Okay, thirty fifty one. So 
I'm gonna round that up to 31 and I will just take, yeah, 31. So 20, 10, and one. Okay. So I think we have everything unstuffed. I'm gonna have to do like a double check, but um, let's see what we've got left for the rest of the month. So um, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 101, 102. Okay, so plenty there. No worries there. Okay, just cause I was a little bit worried. <laughs> okay, and then gas money. Let's see what I've got left there. Um, 20, 40, 60, 65. Okay, no problem there. And then other 20, 30. Okay, that's really good because I think that I'll probably end up using most of it. Um, so I'm kind of glad I unstuffed that money from hobbies. Um, okay, so I'm gonna speed you up, but I need to total all of these together and then add up and see kind of where I need to be in the ballpark. So I'll speed you up. Okay, so one, 26, 58, and then I have to add all those up together, so. Okay, so I should be at 257.72. So 257, 258, 259, somewhere in there. Um, but I do need to take out the $40, so let me do that first. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, so 15, 20, 30, 40. Okay, so that goes back into my change fund for next and stuffing. So let's see what we've got here. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60. Okay, so I am well over what I actually need to take back to the bank and it's just because of how I rounded, but that's fine, like I'm, I'm okay with that. I, it just gives me a little bit of buffer in the account that I use to um, pay the credit cards. So yeah, that will totally work. Um, let me put that in my back to bank envelope. And again, if I didn't say this at the beginning of the, vid of the video, I am just either paying myself back um, or I am taking this back to the bank to pay off credit cards. Um, but like I said, I just needed to know how much money I have left for the rest of the month. I was a little worried, but it's actually a lot better than I thought it would be. Um, like I said, I did have a lot of fun with my family. We we really didn't go anywhere. I have a lot of nieces and nephews that are pretty young still. So a lot of it was just hanging out with them or you know playing outside, which was their favorite thing to do, honestly. Um, but yeah, I had a great time. I really needed the break. And um, yeah, it was really good. I um, This is the, um, it was the anniversary of my um, surgery and kind of all the, the medical stuff that happened, my one year anniversary. And so it was really awesome for me just to be with family and hang out with my mom, see, see my nieces and nephews. And so that was really a great time. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, even though it was a little chaotic. Um, if so, please do all the things, like, leave me a comment or question down below, and subscribe for more. I'll see you next one. Have a great day.